This room, which is called the Rensselaer Augmented and Virtual Environment, was created sort of as a place to incubate ideas surrounding using virtual and augmented reality, both for teaching and for research. There really is a surprising difference between twirling something around on a laptop screen with a mouse and seeing it with your own eyes through a headset and being able to interact with it with your hands. And this offers the opportunity to go to places and experience things that are either difficult to do in a lab or classroom setting or impossible to do. So you can imagine we have a nuclear engineering program so those students can maybe experience you know, what is going on within a nuclear reactor. Chemical engineers can experience various things at the molecular scale. We can have aerospace students inside a turbo machine. That kind of experiential learning is something that we hope could add something to our classes. In terms of augmented reality, we have all sorts of kind of heavy-duty engineering equipment at RPI, you know, things like manufacturing machines and so on, huge industrial robots. And it's really interesting to be able to have something that you put on your head, you're still looking through it, you still see all the real world, but then you can see things superimposed on the real world in terms of how would you maintain this uh, robot, you know, that's going wrong, like what panel do you open and what knob do you turn. We think that there's some really great things that can be done here using virtual reality and augmented reality that will give students the ability to actually do the thing that they're trying to learn how to do.